Hello and welcome to Rock Aritaville. I'm your hostess, Elle Rock, and we are here today to do an unboxing. So here's the box um, just arrived from Amazon. And um, what I'm showing you here is the Illustrated Herbiary, um, which is a book written by Maya Toll. And um, it's a beautiful book um, that really kind of focuses on herbs and um, some of their more deep esoteric meanings. And the book came with a deck of cards. And they are one of my favorite decks, if not my favorite deck. So um, what is all this um, leading up to? Well, on Amazon, I found out that she recently published a new book about animals called The Bestiary. And um, I've really been wanting to get into animal totems and animal spirits recently. Um, and so we are going to take a peek at the um, her new book and her, the, the oracle cards that accompany. So See if I can reposition the camera here a little bit. So this is her new book. This is by Maya Toll. Um, and I'm not sure who the illustrator is. But let's take a quick look here. So in the back of the book is where you find your oracle cards and I'll pull those out here in a sec. I just kind of want to thumb through it. So the illustrations are by Kate O'Hara and um, this is guidance and rituals from 36 inspiring animals and it reads to the four legged and the winged ones and those who swim the sea. Thank you for remembering what we have forgotten and to Andrew and the beasts for navigating this luscious life beside me. So um, the animals in the book are include the white tailed deer, red salmon, common raven, monarch butterfly, spring peeper, common tortoise, black snake, screech owl. And uh, I'm not going to read through all of them because there's there are 36 of them, but you can just get a peek here at what what the ranges are and what the energies, the surrounding energies are um, around that animal. So, for example, the barn owl um, speaks to listening for spirit. So. Every creature of the world is a book or picture and also. A Mirror for Ourselves by Elaine DeLille, 12th Century. We are indeed unique primates, we humans, but we're simply not as different from the rest of the animal kingdom as we used to think. Jane Goodall. So, um, yeah, this really digs into um, the energies. We've got the preface and, of course, the introduction. Um, the bestia the bestiary watch list, which are animals that are on the endangered list. Um, those are marked throughout the book. Uh, how to use the book, hearing spirit song, being the animal and inviting the animal in through ancient trad tradition and ritual, um, inviting animals into your dream times free writing with animals, and then um, it gets into the book, the animals, and their meanings. So it starts, look at that artwork. Oh, isn't it luscious? Oh my goodness. So the white-tailed deer, um, which is pause, assess, and act. And each page um, comes with a meaning for the oracle card and the essence of what the deer stands for or the animal. And then... It's followed by a ritual page. So map your mood. 
and it talks about each animal and the medicine that that animal brings and it asks um, coaching questions here in the book so um, as you read about it it's going to ask you to kind of dig in deeper to your inner deer or what this energy might mean in your life um, and then it has a reflection uh, to reflect upon the animal and how you might um, find your oneness with it or what it what it is that it's representing in your life right now so um we'll just kind of go through the book really quick we've got red salmon common raven monarch butterfly digest your past Evolve into your next becoming, the spring peeper. Steady on, the common tortoise. Black snake, grow your truth. Screech out, get creative. Cow and bull, appreciate the process. Black Bear, Sync with the Cycles. Gray Wolf, Nurture Connections. Broad Winged cat, cat, Katydid, Catydid, which is like a cricket, the cricket family. Love Fiercely, the Whooper Swan. Isn't the art in here beautiful? Work Together, the House Mouse. Find your element, sea turtle. Change your perspective, nut hatch. Stand up for yourself, spotted skunk. Listen for spirit, barn owl. Dive under the surface, orca. Make manifest, beaver. Everything is connected, zigzag spider. Free your inner fire. Pileated, pileated woodpecker. Um, I actually saw a woodpecker not, not more than an hour ago um, outside the window of my kitchen. Um, so woodpeckers, you know, a totem of mine today. Um, Honor lineage, the agent, the Asian elephant. Discover your purpose, earthworm. Renew your life, sea eagle. Transcend yourself, and illusion horse. Deal with the dirt, eastern oyster. Navigate by the sun, honeybee. Know your song, House Finch. You are worthy, Tabby Cat. Delight in the daring, the five lined skink. Key into wisdom, little owl. Shape shift, red fox. Blue damselfly, commune with nature. Slide into joy, river otter. Remember forgetting the human. I love this one because um, I think that we as humans often forget that we are still mammals and part of, you know, the animal species. We're homo sapiens. And um, let's just read the, read through this really quickly. Someday when the animals gather to tell the tales of being, they will say, Remember when humans went through the great forgetting? They forgot they were one of us. They forgot we are brothers and sisters. They forgot they too are of the earth. The animals will shake their heads and ruffle their feathers, remembering the rift and near catastrophic destruction the humans caused in the throes of their forgetting. Even now, humans 
know there is something missing, something lost. We live our lives with a nagging nostalgia, a longing for something we can't quite name. What is it that you're forgetting? So this really talks about just that deeper connection with nature. It's beautiful. And then the um, the section is how to best work with the bestiary cards. So there's a one card spread, a two card um, called the crossing. Um, calling in guidance. Sources and resources. Her thank you section. Um, her first book. Um, I also discovered on Amazon yesterday that she has another book coming out in June 2020 called um, The Christiary, which is a book on all crystals. So um, I'll be personally looking forward to that one to add to the collection here as well. So let's dig into the cards here really quickly. So let me turn the light up here on my backup light. All right. So let's take a peek at these cards. So um, they are, um, oops, here's one that's already pulling itself apart. So you are worthy, um, the tabby cat, and it has um, the page number down here at the bottom of the card. And so um, they come in little packs of four and you just, they easily pull apart. Let's take a look at the rest of them here. We've got Gray Wolf, Spring Peeper, Common Raven, the Monarch. I'll pull these apart here later. House Mouse and Little Owl, the Asian Elephant and the Nuthatch, the Pileated, I'm going to have to figure out that word, I'll have to Google it later, Woodpecker, uh, Whooper Swan, the Common Tortoise and the Screech Owl, Know Your Song, the House Finch, the Zigzag Spider, Earthworm and Sea Eagle, Sea Turtle, Spotted Skunk, Red Fox, and Five Lined Skink, Honey Bee, River Otter, Andalusian Horse, Human, Black Bear, Cow and Bull, black snake and red salmon. So that, my friends, is the bestiary. And um, I'm just gonna pull the cards apart here really quickly. And let's just do a quick little um, draw and see what pops out. Um, thank you, welcome cards. Thank you for being a part of the collection and a part of the Rockaritaville channel. Um, we welcome in your guidance and the guidance of the animals and the animal spirits and totems that we can use as messengers for all of us. Bestiary, do you have any quick messages as we make your introduction here onto the channel? Oh. Digest your past, monarch butterfly. Hmm. And then the river otter just popped out. Now, I haven't had a chance to um, dig into the book, obviously, um, but let's just really quickly, um, and then at the bottom of the deck is Stand Up For Yourself, The Spotted Skunk. Um, let's just really quickly 
page 31. Let's just go read the butterfly really quickly. So I'm already digging the fact that the page number is on the cards. That's super helpful. And I was able to easily flip through it. That's a new addition from her previous deck. So um, digest your past. Before Butterfly can earn her wings, she turns inward, examining all she has been, digesting the pieces of her own past. This is quiet work, womb work. So she shuts herself away from the world to begin the deconstruction. As she performs the rites of unmaking, she sacrifices every bit of self on the altar of transformation. Finally, her body reduced to a soup of cells, Butterfly checks her blueprint, pulling proteins into wings, preparing, finally, for flight. If Monarch Butterfly appears in your life, it's time to begin shedding, digesting your past, and doing the work that prepares you for flight. Wow, that's beautiful. And River Otter wants you to slide into joy. Of course, otters are the most playful animals ever. I just love them. Let's go see what that one has to say really quickly. This fashionista of the waterways stays warm in her plush fur coat and by wiggling and squiggling, generating heat with her ridiculously high metabolism. River Otter's inner fire is fueled by constant snacking on crayfish and crabs. The cynical might say she's joyful because she gets to eat all day and not gain an ounce, but River Otter knows that when you're lit from within, life provides endless amusement. Take that muddy riverbank, for instance, says River Otter says. I see a water slide. Do you see it? River Otter reminds you to actively look for joy. She knows it's there waiting to be found. Oh yeah, proactively looking for joy, especially after you've just um, completely transformed yourself. So um, just a quick check-in with the um, Bestiary book and Oracle deck. Um, a second follow-up to Maya Toll's The Herbiary, and um, a welcome new addition to um, the Rockeritaville Oracle Card lineup. So thanks for tuning in. Um, I hope you enjoyed the preview, and I'm looking forward to seeing you on the channel. Have a great night. Bye.